Hey everyone, this is Swati. Welcome to Pabli. In this video, we are going to see how to get instant alerts on your phone for new Facebook leads. Now, let's say that you are the business person and uh, you have got this new business which you would want to market to empower your business to just develop your reach for which you are using this particular application, Facebook lead ads. And now what you want is every time there's a new lead. So every time there is a new client who visits that advertisement and then there's a new lead generated, you want to receive an instant message, SMS. Now, this is possible. How? By integrating these two applications. Because every time you'll get the message, then you would be able to enhance your reach by contacting that person, by sharing your brochure and etc. See, the, the basic thing is that you want to empower your business. And I am telling you that these two applications can get integrated in a way that you won't have to do anything manually. So here I'm saying that if I integrate these two applications, you will save a lot of time. Now, how you would do that? For this, we have this amazing software, Pabli Connect, which is an integration and automation software where without knowing any coding skills, you would be able to integrate these two applications yourself and how would you do that for that let me take you to my screen so let us begin with the process the first thing that we have to do is we have to type the url pabli.com slash connect and as we do that it is going to take us to this this is the software's landing page and here on the right hand side you can see two options sign in and sign up for free if you are an existing user then you can simply sign in and if you are a new user you can sign up for free and trust me it will not take more than two minutes now being an existing user i'm going to click on sign in here and here it has taken me to the all apps page we provide 100 free tasks every month in the free account of Pabli connect so you do not have to wait for anything you can simply sign up now here since we are doing this integration using Pabli connect software so i'm going to click on access now finally we have reached the dashboard of this software where on the right hand side you can see a small tab create workflow so this blue tab we are supposed to click and a dialog box has appeared which is asking us to name this workflow now here since i'm doing this integration between facebook leads uh, lead ads and msg 91 so i'm going to name it as facebook lead ads to msg 91 integration and now let's click on create so finally this page has two very important events one is trigger and another one is action triggers and events are those two important concepts or those two principles on which this entire automation works trigger basically says when this happens and action says do this basically action is the response of the trigger so here the first application that i'm supposed to choose is facebook lead ads why because i need to generate these leads and then once these new leads are generated then i'm supposed to send an sms so i'm going to click on connect here and then add new connection why because here pavli connect is asking me to connect itself with facebook lead ads account and now let's click on connect with facebook lead ads so see the thing is that i have already logged into my facebook page and that is why this connection was all automated so now here as we come down you can see page lead generation form and page access token so basically what's the page for this i'm going to take you to my facebook account so this is my facebook account where on top here this is the home sign next to this is this pages so i'm going to click on this and show you all the pages that i've already created so these are the pages that i've created and let's say that uh, out of these pages i am supposed to select a page and then i want to advertise it through facebook lead ads so here let's select the page and i am going to select the page grocery store so i'm supposed to advertise this grocery store that i have and there's a lead generation form now since this page only has one form so the form has automatically been captured here if we click on save and send test request now it is asking us to do a test submission so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response to do this test submission we are supposed to click on facebook lead ads testing tool as i do that 
So here, this is the metaphor developers page lead ads testing tool where we have to use this tool to test our API integration and we have to create a test lead to confirm that our integration is set up to receive data correctly. So for this, I'm going to click on this and select my page grocery store and see the form has automatically appeared here. Now let's click on preview form. So here's the form and I'm going to fill in the details. Let's say the name is demo name. Then the phone number is and now let's fill in that email. It is demo at pablytutes.com and now let's click on next here. So submit the form and now I'm going to click on this cross and go back to my Pabli Connect page to see if it has received the response. And here you can see that yes, it has received the response. If you will scroll down, it has full name, phone number and the email address. So basically here what has happened, Pabli Connect and Facebook Lead Ads, these two applications have got connected. The data shared by Facebook Lead Ads has been received by Pabli Connect. Now we have to choose our next application. So let's click on this. So what do we want? We want that as soon as we receive a lead, we want this message to be shared on SMS. So I'm going to select MSG 91 and the action event. So here we have to select send campaign. So let's click on this and now we have to click on connect. So here again, Public Connect is asking us to connect itself with MSG 91 account. So I'm going to click on add new connection. Now here to set up this connection, it is asking us for this API key. So to generate this API key, I'm going to take you to MSG 91 account and how to generate is also explained here. You can click on this hyperlink and get the information. So now let's go to our MSG 91 page. And once you are here on the home page, you have to click on one API. So then proceed to SMS. Now here on the left hand side, you can see configuration and auth key. So let's click on this auth key and here we have to fill in the information. So now I'm going to click on next and now it has asked us for this OTP. So let me just get this OTP. So now I'm going to click on verify here. Now here you can see the testing API. This is the auth key. I'm going to copy this down, go back to Pabli Connect and enter it here. Then click on save. So basically here we can see that MSG 91 and Pabli Connect, these two applications have got integrated properly. So it is now asking us for the slug. Basically, it, we have to select the campaign which we want to send to our user. Now, if I'll take you back to my MSG page, this is the home page. And here you can see campaign. I'm going to just show it to you. So these are the two campaigns that we have already created. You can create your own campaign by clicking on this new campaign tab. So taking you back to Pabli Connect. Here, this is the slug that I've already selected and now to mobile number. So I'm going to put in the mobile number here. Now here, this is the mobile number of the user to whom we are supposed to send the SMS. So this is always going to be static and not dynamic. So let me quickly fill in the data. This is the mobile number. Remember, it is written that you have to write the number with the country code. Now we have to give the name. So let's say the name of the person is dummy test as we will scroll down here so you can see name username and mobile so this information will come from the lead that we have gathered from facebook lead ads so here i'm going to map the data mapping means we already have received some information in the previous steps and now we are going to take that information so i'm going to click on facebook lead ads and here i'm going to type name so this is the name let's click on this now the username again we are going to map the same data click on this and here is the name now the mobile number so like phone number so this is the phone number so yes we have received this and now i'm going to click on save and send test so let's click on this and here you can see that we have received the response now we need to check that if we have received the sms on our phone so now you can see that yes, we have received this SMS and I have placed the screenshot of the SMS that I have received on my phone. So here it is written. Hello demo name sign up into your account with username demo name mobile number this team MSG 91. So finally, this means that our entire process is successful. These two applications have got integrated successfully. And now we are going to see this in real time. So I'm going to go back to Meta for developers page, my apps, 
and then here I'm going to go to tools and then if I scroll down lead ads RTU debug tool and here again I'm going to select the page and now I'm going to click on preview form so as I click on this so let's fill in the details let's say this time the name is testing one two three then we have the phone number and the email address is testing at pablitudes.com and now I'm going to click on next and submit the form now as soon as we have filled in this form we should receive this SMS so let me check if we have received and yes here you can see that we have received this SMS and I have placed a screenshot for the same so I hope this is very much clear to you I'm going to take you back to Pabli Connect and here let us just go through the entire process once again this was a very simple two process integration where first our trigger application was Facebook lead ads and the trigger event was new lead instant and then we had connected this with MSG 91 this was the action app and the action event one was sent campaign in case of any doubts you can refer to the workflow which is given in the video description and also you can clone this workflow to process it immediately if in case you have any queries or suggestion then you can always write to us